Those devastating wildfires in California, they are still growing this morning. Let's take a live look from our KABC chopper. Yeah, you can see, you know, even it's so bad, you can even see the smoke from outer space. Uh, I mean, the fires, they've already destroyed hundreds of buildings, and ABC's Marcus Moore is on the scene in one of the hardest hit areas in California. Good morning, Marcus. And Michael, right now, new fires are breaking out in Los Angeles to our south. Meantime, here near the beach community of La Clachita, they are under a mandatory evacuation order because of these flames that we're watching march down this ridge that is running right along the 101 freeway. These flames and so many others in Southern California are feeding on this dry, thick brush. This morning, the fire is spreading to the upscale Los Angeles neighborhood of Bel Air. The flames growing so intense, they're pushing over the 405 freeway. A natural catastrophe unfolding overnight as the fires roaring across Southern California hillsides devour over 70,000 acres. Towering flames pushed by Santa Ana winds roaring through neighborhoods, feeding on thick brush, illuminating the night sky for a second day. This is a multi-day weather event projected to last until Friday. This has only just begun. As many as four fires are burning across Southern California. The largest, the Thomas Fire, destroying hundreds of homes and buildings in Ventura County, forcing more than 27,000 residents and even some animals to safer ground. Mandatory evacuation due to the fire. Mandatory evacuations still in place for many here as flames continue their assault. Wow. It's, can you hear that coming down right now? That was, I think our roof just collapsed. Tracy Bird watching in disbelief, her home of 12 years gone before her eyes. We can't even describe what I'm thinking. My mind is not even really connecting with it all yet. And yet there it is. Tense flames have already destroyed a home and engulfed this car. Similar scenes across this area as the wind continues to blow. It's only fanning the flames here in Southern California. Well, I mean, it is definitely heartbreaking. Derek Olson's family home of 40 years gone in hours, but his faith remains. Our faith in God is what gets us through this. You know, we know that um, our God has our backs and uh, you know, we're just going to see what happens next. In Los Angeles County, over 150,000 forced from their homes by the fast-moving Creek Fire. Three firefighters hurt fighting that blaze overnight as crews in Santa Clarita battle back a third fire, now jumping highways and burning in two counties this morning. And this morning, so far, we have only seen calm winds, and that's impacted how quickly we've seen these flames able to spread along this ridge. And that is encouraging news for residents here. Our Matt Gutman is farther south in Los Angeles. Hey, Marcus and Rob, right now I'm just south of what is called the Skirball area. This is called the Skirball Fire, and you can see how that wind that you guys have been seeing farther north is whipping up. The flames in the trees here is engulfing this entire part of Los Angeles. We're talking right near the Getty Center, which you might be able to see over there. There are multi-million dollar homes in these hills right now. And right on the other side of me, right there, you can see that's the overpass of the 405, one of the most trafficked roads in the entire country. Uh, right now, it's shut down. Many of the roads around here are as well uh, because this fire is moving so rapidly. It is not in any way under control. Uh, there are dozens of fire trucks around me and obviously police officers everywhere trying to contain first the traffic. They're not even worried about the fire and trying to evacuate folks from their homes as this fire continues to rage, to rage out here. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.